I want to do a two-part uh, body uh, video for you guys. Uh, I've looked all over on the internet. I found one guy that uh, had showed photos on a forum, but uh, I didn't find anything on YouTube. So I figured uh, I'd give it a try, and it worked out. And just wanted to show everybody how he did it and how I was able to to do it. So basically, I took the uh, canopy. He used the uh, the other canopies that have the um, the red body or the green body and has a black strip down the side. It makes it a little bit easier, but I did it with this one. I just took a sharp pair of scissors and cut the body in half, basically uh, before the uh, as you can see before the the, the holes for the uh, connecting it to the to the frame on the uh, the helicopter and reinforced them inside with uh, plastic and I used uh, like he said I used some plastic that came from you know an item that you buy at the store and uh, and all I did was use you could use a plastic glue but I used super glue and it worked very well and uh, to put the holes in it I used the soldering iron and uh, hot soldering iron and just poked the holes through and uh, was able to get it uh, um, to make the holes very cleanly. So basically, it's a two-part body now. All I have to do is screw the, f the front on. And then, um, if you see in the back, I've added the little connectors onto the top and the bottom so that they match up. And just super glued them inside. And then... Uh, I put it together and marked the holes with a felt marker so that I knew where they would uh, line up. And so now instead of having to take the, uh, as you know, you have to, on the East Sky Big Llama, you have to take off the the blades and the uh, fly bar to uh, get at any of the inside components. And it just makes it easier. So uh, I'll put it back together and I'll show you what it uh, looks like uh, all all in one piece. Uh, it pretty much uh, 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 fits right back together, and uh, it's and because it was cut with a sharp pair of scissors, you can hardly tell uh, where the the lines match up on on the body. So uh, I'll show you here in a second what it looks like, and uh, and uh, back together. Okay, so here's the body back together again, and uh, as you can see, it is noticeable, but. Uh, it actually looks pretty good and it, it and it's very stable especially since you, I've uh, added uh, plastic super glued it uh, to the back of the this part of the body uh, very stable uh, probably just as good as uh, the original body but again makes it very easy to get in and out of uh, the front end or, or being able to work on the, the helicopter without uh, removing the the blades and the fly bar uh, just to get in and do um, small maintenance inside so uh, that's it um, if you have any questions uh, go ahead and write me um, and again uh, when I did uh, put this back together again I found that if you put the lower screws in first and then the upper ones last it uh, it works a lot easier it's easier uh, to put back together so uh, that's it